G'day Greg, Sky here. <laughs> Never gets old that. Anyway, it's product review time once again, and today I'm going to be reviewing this product right here. Cole's Cheeseburger Pie. An Australian beef pickle tomato sauce and cheese filling encased in crisp golden pastry. Topped with sesame seeds. How good does that sound? And how good does it look too? Mm -mm -mm. But I wonder how much pickle, cheese, beef and all the other things is actually in this. Well, let's find out. Well, ingredients, filling, Australian beef 33%, onion 5%, gherkin 4%, and the rest of it is so small I can't even read it. But I wonder how many of these I can have in a day, because if they're any good, I'm going to be eating 20 to 30. All right. Well, quantity per serving, it's about 1,800 kilojoules. So times two, that'd be about 3,600. So I could have like nearly six of these every day and still stay within my daily average daily intake. Six pies a day. Now we're talking. All right, well, let's crack this open and see what the pie looks like. All right. Okay. Oh, okay, well, there we go. I mean, that looks like a pie, doesn't it? It's got funny ridges on its roof. But, I mean, it looks good so far. Right, how do we cook this? Well, on the back of it, it says I can either use the oven or the microwave, but there's no way I'm using those. I'm going to be using my trusty old air fryer. So we'll pop out the drawer, whack the pie in. 180 degrees for 25 minutes. Well, it seems to have all the ingredients there in a cheeseburger. Meat, gherkins, cheese. Man, I can't wait to try this. All right, well, the meat pie's ready. Woo wee. There she blows. Looks a little bit overcooked. Oh, well, what can you do? Except cook it normally and not overcook it. But let's just crack open the top to suss out its guts. Oh. Oh, all right, well, that looks like a bit of cheese there, and what's this, a gherkin? Please be a gherkin. No, it looks like a big chunk of meat. Hmm, oh boy, it smells good, i got to say. How about I cut it in half? Oh, yeah, that gives a better picture. Take a look at that cheese and the cheeseburger. That's got to be about 40%, I reckon. Maybe 30. But mmm, looks all right. Now, does the meat pie look anything like the photo there? Well, I mean, if the, the photo was a cheeseburger that had been sat on and uh, been in your car for six years, then yes! But the resemblance isn't exactly the same, is it? How about we start off with some of this crispy golden pastry? Looks all right, considering I burnt it. Mmm. I do love the taste of sesame seeds. It, it's just like a cheeseburger with the sesame seeds. Unless it's McDonald's cheeseburger, then they don't have it. But Hungry Jack's does. All right, let's see how much of a cheeseburger this tastes like. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, wow. Oh, yum. This actually does have a taste that resembles a cheeseburger. It's not exact, but, mate, it's a meat pie, so it's not going to be exact, is it? But the flavor of this is really nice. Mmm. Yum. Oh. That cheese in this has got a sort of a smoky flavor. I can sort of taste like tomato sauce and mustard in there. And you can get a hint of those pickled gherkins or whatever that was in this thing. And the flavour altogether just tastes really nice. Mmm. Oh, I'm enjoying these. Oh, I just want to keep eating this. But I wonder what the Grego meter will think about it. <laughs> uh, uh. Well, so far so good. It's going in the right direction. Oh, hang on. It seems to be going the other way. 
which is kind of strange because I thought it tasted really nice. So it's a bit weird that it's going down. Oh, hang on. Seems to be going back up. Seems to be going all the way up. Seems to be going all the way. Oh no, it's going back down. Oh, that's a shame. I really thought this was really not. Oh! Well, there you go. The Grego meter gave it a big thumbs up. So, but you can't argue with that. Believe me, many have tried. But yeah, this cheeseburger pie is really nice. And well, they do have a couple of other ones. They got like a burrito one, I think, and one that's already got sauce in it. I didn't really feel like hot sauce in a pie. And well, a burrito one sort of didn't grab my attention, but. After trying this cheeseburger one, mate, maybe I should go and try that burrito one. It might be pretty good. There you go. Have you tried any of these pies before? If you have, let me know down below. And if there's something you really want me to try in the frozen section of the supermarket, let me know, because I'll go and try it. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time I review something frozen. See you then. Oh yeah. This is